Hello everyone, Man's Not Honor from EpicBot. Today I'm going to show you how to set up and run Proslayer using EpicBot. To start off, you want to make your way to EpicBot.com and you'll have to purchase Proslayer. It is a unlimited script for $15. It is made by Sean and here is everything that you can get with Proslayer. You can get all of these Slayer Masters. You can get these core features, which is majority of Slayer tasks and locations. Toggle if you want to skip specific tasks, and toggle if you want to use the cannon. It will prayer switch and avoid projectiles at hydras. And it will also use things like salt on slugs to finish off your task. So it will also detect if you are fighting dragons. It will also detect that you need an anti-dragon fire shield or an anti-fire potion. It does many things like that, and also prey range whenever passing trolls. And you can also use Guthans to heal. You can also loot options, which is by value. You can loot bones. You can also have the option to bury the bones. You can pick up the arrows. And you can uh, also do only the personal kills. So if you kill something, it will only loot yours instead of looting other people's that they didn't loot. You also have the ability to ALK selected looted items. It will also loot Brimstone Keys if you're on Koner, Ancient Shards, um, and it will also loot things like Whips, Daggers, and Heads if I'm Abyssal Demons. You can also have it choose if you wanted to refill on Combat Bracelets, any of the Glories, Games and Necklaces, things like that so you can teleport different places. Um, different kinds of travel things that you have. I will also have a link to this page down in the description so you can go and check and read through this yourself. But it has a bunch of different tasks and locations supported. has a whole bunch of them. This is what the GUI will look like. So let's go ahead and pull that up. So here's this. So here's the GUI. To start off, you'll want to go to General. If you have a, want to make a profile, you can save profiles here, load profiles, and delete profiles. It is Slayer, what master you want to use. So let's go ahead and do best possible. If you wanted to hide the username, which will put a big block around the username if you want that. You can also go to task configuration. Here's a whole thing of all the tasks that you want. So if you want to use a cannon for certain ones, you can just tick that. If you want to skip the certain tasks, you can just tick that. Note that if you wanted to skip, you will have to have Slayer points already there so you can, so it's able to skip that task. So let's go ahead and let's leave this the way it is right now. Let's go to healing. So let's say you want food count. Let's say you want 20 of, let's say, sharks. You do that, you have a percent that you want to eat at. So let's do let's do 60, let's do 70%. If you want Guthans to heal, you can just take that. Looting, you loot items by value. So let's do let's do 4,000. That's the minimum that it goes off the GE price. So that's the minimum that you want it to loot in value. Here's loot bones, berry bones, loot arrows, and only personal kills. Let's do that. Outlooted items. Here's travel. So purchase uh, charge jewelry if out of charges. Let's do glory, games necklace, ring of dueling. If you have a lunar staff or drawman staff, to use fairy rings. And ectophile if you have that. And royal sea positive if you have that. Combat if you want to use special attacks. So if you want it to do the, let's say, army of god sword special attack, you can choose that. But as of right now, let's not do that. Um, protection prayers is appropriate task. Let's go ahead and tick that. And bank if out of prayer potions. Yes, number of prayer potions you want to do. So let's go ahead and just untick that for right now. Training goals. So here is training goals, how it's in in pro fighter, different things like that. So if you want to use training goals, let's say um, attack until level, let's just say 85. You would hit add, strength, 85, add, defense, add. So what it does is 
it will train your attack until you hit level 85 attack. Then it will go to strength until you hit level 85. So you could do it very complex. You could do it till 5 if you're starting off. And then you could make it strength till 5, so on and so forth. So let's go ahead and remove all of these. So let's not set any training goals. So right now, let's go ahead and if you want to save this, you would just type in um, just a random name here. You would hit save profile and it will pop up and profile name. So let's go ahead and start the script. Let's run to the nearest bank. I'm going to go ahead and pause this so I can get some armor. Let's go ahead. Let's just take this stuff out for right now, just as a test. Let's send it to If you do not have a Slayer Gem, it will go and purchase one from the Slayer Master that you have chosen. It will now make its way to GE and purchase anything that is needed, such as the Ring of Duelings that you requested, the game's necklaces, or any kind of things that is requested for the current thing, like a anti-fire shield, anti-fire potion, and then it will make its way back to the Slayer task. Now that it has bought everything that is needed, it will run to the fire giant's location and start killing them. It picks out a certain location. There's generated presets for each monster, just how it is for each task. So once it's here, we will start attacking them. Here it also pulls up your XP gained, XP an hour. It also has the uh, looted items and the total profit you have for the looted items, your kills left, your current location, your total slave points that you've gotten, and your total tasks that you've completed. It also has your current tasks, which is fire giants, and then your run time. So now that it's here, notice that, boom, there's also slayer. So slayer level 9 plus 0, but each time that it kills it, it will go up. It also pulls up your time to level for each one. And that is everything for this script. If you have any kind of questions, comments, concerns, um, feel free to join the Discord. After it does this, it will go back to Neve and get a new task and just constantly repeat itself and see, gain a level there. And it will constantly repeat itself and go back and forth and complete task as it has been described. And yeah, if you have any kind of questions, comments, concerns, post in the Discord. Don't forget you have to go buy the script at epicbot.com under scripts. $15 for a one-time purchase um, for an amazing script made by Sean. And yeah, good luck botting, happy botting, and I'll see you in the next one, guys.